Hello friends, welcome to Selenium Point. My name is Herschel and I am going to teach you Selenium from scratch. So let's start with second tutorial which is environment setup for web driver. Earlier we have seen introduction of the Selenium ID, RC and web driver. Today we are going to cover installation of the JDK, download of the Eclipse, then download of the Selenium 3.0 jars configure it with Eclipse and run a simple program which is open the URL in Eclipse. So uh, we can use various language but with our tutorials we can see we are going to see Selenium with Java. So the prerequisites is the you must have the Java installed in your system. So the first step is install the JDK. Go to this URL Uh, which is recommended one oracle.com install java first according to your operating system uh, choose uh, anyone accept the license i have mac so i will choose this one uh, but i have already installed the java in my system so i am going to skip this step you can download uh, any 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 of these and just double click on the exe file if you are a windowed user and do next next you can install the jdk just to verify whether java is installed or not open your command prompt or i can say terminal and type the command java hyphen version you can see here in my system java version 1.8 is installed that's it so once you install the jdk you must have editor which is Eclipse or NetBeam. In our case, I'm going to download the Eclipse. Go to eclipse.org. You can download Eclipse installable as well as you can download Eclipse package. Choose uh, your operating system, Windows, Linux or Mac and download the same. Okay, once you download the Eclipse, open it. Uh, Eclipse is open now. Create a project, simple project, simple Java project. I can say let it be Selenium Point Tutorial. Here it is, project has been created. Now, create a simple class. You can skip the creation of the package, it will go to default package. Open URL would be the class because we are going to see uh, opening any URL with the Selenium. Okay, here it is. So we have seen that we have just created simple Eclipse, uh, like simple Java class. Now we have to configure Selenium jars with this project. So for that, we have to download the jars. In our third step, I have mentioned here download Selenium web driver jars. So go to Selenium official website, which is seleniumhq.org in download section. You can see the different languages jars available here. So Java, C, Hash, Ruby, Python, JavaScript. In our case, we are using Java, so we have to download this. Just click on download, it will download the zip file. I already downloaded. Once you downloaded, Go to your downloaded location. You can see the Selenium jars are downloaded. So it has leap folder inside the leap folder. You can see all the jars and these jars. Now open Eclipse. Right click on the project. Go to the properties. Go to the Java build path libraries and add external jars then you can see you have to go to that part where you have kept the selenium 3.0 jars so this is one jar 
include it again add external jars and all the jars inside the lib folder you have to include all those jars Next. click ok that's it guys now selenium has been configured let's see create object of driver web driver is equal to new firefox driver okay uh, here it is you are able to see import web driver that means jars are configured for firefox import firefox driver From Selenium 3.0, we must have to uh, import uh, Gecko driver for Firefox with Selenium 2.0, which was the earlier version. For that version, Firefox did not need any driver, but now onwards with Selenium 3.0, we need to download the Gecko driver for Firefox as well. So let's download it first because unless and until we are not able to download, it will not open. So to download the gecko driver again go to selenium website in download section in in the third party browser you can see the mozilla gecko driver here according to your version like uh, mac or linux or windows and 32 or 64 bit download the zip file for the dow uh, gecko driver i have already downloaded I have downloaded the jar and so here it is like I have downloaded the gecko driver in windows case it would be a gecko driver dot exe just include its path set the system property system dot set properties key and value key would be Web driver dot gecko dot driver that's it and the value is the path of that gecko driver exe in my case it is okay in my case uh, I have kept gecko driver in this location in my download folder uh, in Windows case, guys, you make sure that you are giving the path with extension of Gecko driver. That would be Gecko driver dot exe. Okay. So um, let's open the URL. That is driver dot get command. Get. selenium.point.com let's run this program now it will open the firefox it has already opened see and it, it, it has opened the selenium.com that's it guys so this is the second tutorial just introductory about setting up the selenium environment uh, <clears throat> keep watching the next videos i will keep posting the next videos onward thanks thanks guys thanks for watching the video